Hi, this is Susie, Susie Gemini, and today's video is a special thank you to Shauna of Shauna Ray Tarot for sending me this beautiful deck, Oracle of the Wilder Ones by Sharon McLeod. Messages and Affirmations from the Wilderness or Wilderness. This is a, a deck that I have been wanting and it was on my wish list. And Shauna, who I just love and adore and is my friend in real life off of YouTube, sent this beautiful deck for my birthday. And I wanted to share the cards with you and then do a draw for all of us. Timeless draw. Oracle of the Wilder Woods, fairies, elementals, prophecy, and wonder from a whimsical world charged with insight, symbolism, and premonition. These unique messengers are here with guidance and affirmations to invoke your inner wilderness and bring joy and adventure to all you do. And what I like about this is you use your intuition. I read the guidebook, by the way, I just love the card stock because I've been playing around with the deck and just studying the art. The box is amazing. The book is a little bit uh, thin, but you don't really need a thick, chunky book because as the author states, Sharon McLeod, uh, you're supposed to use your intuition. And she even uh, shows symbols to look for in, in the cards. Like the other day, I found, I pulled a card with the bee, and it talked about abundance, creation, pollinating your dreams, and evolution. So it's a really symbolic deck. And now I thought I'd share some cards. I'm not going to read them all to you, because then um, I just want to show you, I might read a few as we go. And they're not in order how it arrived. And Shauna, I love this deck, so thank you again. Sorry if some are in reverse. Maybe I'll read one. In unexpected happiness, my path is smooth and filled with joyous surprises. Joyful new connections. Love the owls. I love this artwork. I first saw this deck on Avalon, Avalon Cameron's channel, and she she really liked the deck too, but she said the artwork was simple. Don't quote me if I'm not quoting her perfectly, but I like simple art. It, it just, it, the messages do flow and come uh, to me when I look at, at I use my intuition. And I'm not saying she didn't like the deck. She just said it was simple art. A shift in perspective. I see things with clarity and embrace positive change. Look at pretty. I really like this one. And this one came up the other day when I was kind of having a rough day. Uh, burdened by circumstance. I heal with courage and stand up to injustice. And by the way, this whole deck brought tears to my eyes because uh, some days I'm doing really good and other days I'm not. And that's just honest about missing my George, who, if you guys don't know, passed away. In March but I'm in a great mood it's a beautiful weekend so I will talk about that and thank you for all the love everyone has sent me exciting news satisfying projects rewarding possibilities await me and by the way the author is an artist is from Australia small trials annoyance I see every situation with love anyways I highly recommend this deck the symbols alone, you could get lost in for hours, I think. Success and gain through hard work, I thrive in all aspects of life. 
Yes, let's all thrive in the age of Aquarius, not just survive. Free time, awareness, and awakenings. My progress has purpose and is divinely guided. Anyways, I'm sure most of you have seen this deck, but if not, I just can't say how much enough that I love it. I just adore it. A chance to practice forgiveness. I am love. I forgive those who have hurt me. Dedication inspires imagination. I express myself freely, creatively, and gleefully. I also like this deck because I think it could be used for manifestation. And I also think it can be used for shadow work. It says here, stride into a dreamt future with graceful purpose. My soul's at ease and love fills my heart. Anyways, I wanted to just share this deck with you guys, and I will be filming some astrology in the next few days and posting it, because we have some beautiful astrology to talk about for summer, and some not so great things, but hey, it's how we use astrology as a tool, it's how we respond to the energies, friends, family, and gatherings. Look at the kitty. And there's people and kitties. I love it. And the birds are out singing. I can hear them. I live in a very old house, and because of it, you can hear almost anything uh, outside. I love her. And, that, and she is the person that's on the cover. An honest and unique offering is appreciated. I adore my differences. They make me one of a kind. Love it. What is brewed will boil. I have faith in myself and trust my decisions. I'll put Shauna's uh, channel, YouTube channel, in the uh, section where video description. She has a wonderful, there's a planchette. She has a wonderful YouTube channel. Have faith in yourself and trust the process. I am right where I'm supposed to be. Isn't that the truth? Okay, guys, this will be a timeless reading. Thank you uh, for watching that. I'm not the best walkthrough person, but I, I just wanted to just say, Shauna, that deck came at the right time, and it was really nice to receive a birthday present, and that does not mean I want more gifts from any subscribers or friends. I just, I, I didn't expect it, and that's, whoa, I'm going to look at this card. I didn't expect it, so it made it just so much more, uh, sweeter so thank you shauna okay every day is a chance for change i walk into the life i love with grace and ease by the way guys the moment i got this deck and i started working with it over the last couple days this is coming up a lot so every day is a chance for change it is never too late to turn anything around in life at any moment we can make a u-turn Thank you guys for watching. I love you, Shauna, and please like and subscribe. See you guys soon. I'll be uploading some astrology next week. Much love, everybody.